Hey, Jules. Okay, I know you have a busy schedule. Yes, yes, yes. Do you do all of your cleaning in one day? I do. You do all of your cleaning know, in one day. I know people think that's crazy, but I have two reasons. Number one yeah. is if you separate it out, like, oh, on Thursdays I do the upstairs. Do you know Friday I do? It's like, yeah. you're cleaning every single day of the week. Forever. Like, for, that's how forever. I feel. That's right? how I there's, feel. Like, your kitchen you're always redoing, right? Yes. That's how the, and the every other night. Role, so the thing that I have, Trace, honestly, I've got like little do's and don'ts. Okay. okay. Are no-no's. Don't do it this way. Do it that way. Yeah. To speed up the cleaning. Every tip will give you ideas of how to make things cleaner and faster. Okay. So the number one do yes. is do enlist anyone who puts a pet on a pillow yeah. in your home to clean. Everyone cleans. Uh, everyone. I don't care age. Okay. I don't care sex. I don't care. You clean. It's the hassle of getting them to do it. I know. You know what I, I know. mean? It is. Because I grew up in that home. Saturday yes. mornings, everyone get up and clean. Yes. And my sister did the bathrooms, and I did the dusting and the vacuuming. And I was like, oh, I don't really want to do that. But now, like, we're cleaning all the time. Exactly. So it is better you to gotta just do it. You got to do it. And you have to have your expectations, all right? Okay. The, you oh, know, your okay. bathroom was cleaned by a nine-year-old today. Yeah. Okay. So let's just realize what it's yes. going to look like. It's but not great. On. It's what it is. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, 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 so right. yeah, so got some ideas starting in the different rooms in the house. And we're gonna start in the bedroom. The bedroom, okay, so the number one don't do in the bedroom yeah. is don't start a load of laundry till the other one is finished. Well, now, then I'll never do laundry. Okay. <laughs> it takes me a good four days to get through well, loads. Well, this is exactly, this load of laundry right here, it looks like it's finished. Oh, no, it's not finished. It's not, not finished. Not close. It has to be put away. Right. It doesn't go on the <laughs> stairs. It doesn't no. end up on a bed. You've got to put it away. It's on the table in the basement, my Ikea table in the basement, several piles. Yeah, no, that is Just not done. Just waiting for someone that's to put them done. away. So that's going to cause so much mess and so much headache. It's very annoying. Finish your laundry is one of the easiest ways to clean your room. Okay. The other way is your bed sheets. Don't yeah. just have one set of sheets. No. Must have at least two. Yeah. I know that sounds like an investment, mm -hmm. but it's an investment on your time as well. Yeah. So you can change your sheets quickly. This is a great set. It's from Tuck, which is a Canadian company, okay. and I just adore it. They're made out of organic cotton but what I love the most Trace look at this on the fitted sheet where you're throwing it around trying to make yeah. your bed it says right here this is your top like it just top. tells you there's a label yeah I'm like oh my god how awesome is that smart so you know what the other tip is when you're storing your bed sheets yeah. store them together so you've got your I whole like that king you fold set. that bed sheet how I fold mine <laughs> hey look it's not no it's real no watching it right we just want to make sure it's clean yep. and it's all stored together so there okay. we go that's beautiful Perfect. okay let's go to the bathroom there's lots to do in there right okay so very quickly in the bathroom it's the number mm -hmm. one is don't avoid scrubbing the toilet no you get all you these products scrub. that are like oh put all this blue stuff and walk away for a year and come back and it's perfectly clean <laughs> yeah like no okay no. it doesn't work that way what happens is that stuff ends up <laughs> rotting away at the porcelain of your toilet right so get a product that you're comfortable with let it set for maybe a minute and then get in there and scrub the toilet I'm sorry, it has to happen. Okay, it has okay, to happen. Okay, the other one, this is good. This is brand new. Just, you know, brand new. Okay, yeah, good. Brand new. Just brought the, brought the <laughs> toilet brush that thing right at me. for the show. Um, so, this is the tip. Do not put your toilet bowl brush back into the holder wet. Well, what do we do with oh, it? I, though? I know, right? Okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to scrub your toilet. Yeah. And then you're going to lift the toilet seat and you're going to put it down like this. So, this will be dripping into the bowl. Oh, and when it's smart. fully dry, it goes back in here. Oh, you're smart. Right? You yeah, like that? Very smart. Okay, last one in the bathroom is don't just put your toilet paper roll onto the onto the holder. Okay. You're gonna do the essential oil trick. This is awesome. Okay. Saw this on TikTok, totally works. So you're gonna take lavender essential oil, drop a couple drops onto the cardboard mm -hmm. of each side. Then you'll put it on the roll. Yeah. And every time someone pulls that toilet paper, whoo, lavender. Whoo, oh, lavender. Look at you, Martha right. Stewart. Right. right? Very nice. Okay, and it smells so good. Are we moving on to the kitchen? We're on the kitchen. This is the room that you clean all of the time. All the so time. So number one is you want to get a great all-purpose spray to yes. make things easier. This one I adore. This one's from Magwood. It's just a great friend oh, of mine Trish, that makes yeah. it. Trish, right? Yeah. So it's all natural. It's awesome. But here's the thing. Don't spray and wipe. You know, you see it on TV. Spray, wipe, spray, wipe, and then they're done. Yeah, yeah. as if. Okay, <laughs> what you have to do is spray the entire counter. Okay. Walk back and get your cloth and wipe. And the reason you do that is because, again, the product needs a minute to work. Mm -hmm. Think about when you get your hair colored. You don't put your hair color on and then wash it off right away. Right. Right, even your conditioner. Everything takes a little bit it's of time. It's set. Set, so let mm -hmm. that set. The other one is don't wipe in circles. Yeah. And television, television, 1950s television. Yeah. yeah. No. Reality is what you're doing there is you're just spreading dirt. You've like there and you're wiping around and you're wiping around the dirt again. Mm -hmm. So what you want to do is almost like a Z formation. 
back and forth and go down. Mm. My kids are excellent at this. They learned it at summer camp. It's fun. Right? And, and then there. the dirt's at the very at, end. At the very bottom. Yeah. That is it. Okay, very good. Um, you want to talk a little bit about washing the, the cutting boards? Why can't I think of the name? The, the wooden it, things. The wooden things, but that's all you have to think of is yes. wooden things. What do we do with the wooden, wooden things? Wooden things do not ever put them into the dishwasher. Right. Because the dishwasher will actually crack them. You ever yep. see those wooden spoons that got to crack down them? Absolutely. All my mom's of mine house. do. Yes, and my mother's house. <laughs> I'm like, Mom, please, can we, can we, can we do yes, something else do. with those. Uh, so that's what happens if you put them in the dishwasher. So what you want to do to wash any of your wooden utensils is to use a lemon. And these are your friends. I can talk about lemons for about 100 years. Yes. I love lemons. Lemons are your friend. If you don't have lemons in your kitchen, you're not truly cleaning. Right. You can use a lemon <laughs> to clean your sink. You can use a lemon to clean your cutting boards. You can use a lemon to clean your cheese grater. You right. can even use a lemon in your hair. You, you can, can put use a lemon, lemon in your vodka tonic. Even better. And then the cleaning. <laughs> It's absolutely perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Very good tips, Jules. Give it up for Jules. That's